I'm James. Yo soy Ana. Ahoy! Three months ago, we started an epic adventure to sail around Cape Horn. I was a Navy navigator aboard a submarine and bought my first cruising catamaran after I got out. But after 45,000 miles, it broke in half. Uh, feel comfortable leaving uh, the vessel behind over. But thanks to our amazing subscribers, we were able to kickstart a new boat and embark on our biggest adventure to date. <laughs> bringing some of our awesome backers and all of you along for the ride. I'm going crazy. But the biggest adventure of all was just beginning. Join us on Sailing Zingaro. I have got a metric ass load of work to do. So what am I gonna do first? The coolest job, I'm gonna play with the lights. <laughs> In today's episode, we sail 300 nautical miles to San Andres to pick up some important parts for the boat that are essential for sailing around Cape Horn. I have a blast installing everything. It's just f***ing ridiculous. We inspect a mysterious boat found drifting in the ocean. I wouldn't pay one dollar for that thing. And we catch some tuna for lunch. Get it, get it, get it, pull that f***er in! Hey! Right before we leave, as if on cue, the boys came through with some vegetables. Muchas gracias. Let me get that from you, bro. Thank you. Oh my god. Smoothies for days. I love it. This is amazing because we just got off 10 days of charter and we don't have anything left. So nothing for smoothies, nothing for the trip. Uh, we would have been just boxed and, and canned stuff. So, oh, thank you ch chicos. Muchas gracias. Well, we got all that for 70 bucks delivered to the boat. I think that's a pretty good deal. That's not bad. And I would pay almost anything for a milkshake right now. So that's great. We got vegetables, we're ready to go. Come with us, come on. Look at the quality of fruit they have in this country. It is insane. Wow. Try it. Mmm. <laughs> After stocking up on food, mm. we took a relaxing 300 nautical mile trip north to San Andreas Island to pick up our new gear. By coming to San Andreas, which is actually owned by Colombia, we saved nearly $4,000 in import duties that Panama wanted to charge us. San Andreas is very special because it's one of the unique islands in the Caribbean with zero import duties. Okay, I only have two boxes left. Mama, say hi. Hi. Georgia, say hi. Hello. This is Georgia, this is my mama. I'm supposed to say hi, Mike Nolan. Hi, Magnolia. Mike Nolan. Oh, Mike Nolan. Yeah, All right. your followers. Cool. <laughs> hi, Mike. What's up, buddy? Mm -hmm. uh, so the only boxes left are this and that. It, wait a minute. Yeah, that box is the um, washing machine. and I don't know where to put that yet. That is the water heater and that's going to go back because it's just too big. I knew it was too big. It's like double too big. I need some half, half that size. That's an 80 liter. I need a 40 liter. And that is the water maker. So I'm going to install that later. But most of the other stuff's done. I was going to show you guys what the first job I'm going to do after putting all that stuff away. It took me a good day and a half to get all that stuff stowed. I'll show you where I put it all. It's uh, kind of everywhere. There's the fridge, just cut some batteries. I've put some batteries in the floor already. Um, there's a battery charging right there. There's some stuff. Oh man, this, this boat is trashed. Sewing machine, new vacuum cleaner. This is the tool for the um, up and door connectors. It's, a, it's like an um, expansion tool. 
so that's nice to have. And then more batteries and paint. That's all bottom paint. That's the rest of the fridge, the induction cooktop, some painting stuff, and the two toilets are down there. All right. So I have got a metric ass load of work to do. I've had this fridge installed for about a month now and I, I'm getting problems with it when it's really hot. I think not because the fridge is bad but because we have air leaks. See this? This is from the old install. There's also one down below it. There's also a bunch of pinholes here. I'm gonna fill every single one of these holes with a new product that I got from Total Boat. They sent me this thing called Fixo. Fixo is a tube with a special mixing valve that you just put into. It's really cool, it's epoxy mixed with silica. You just put it into a um, caulking gun and there you go. This is the new cold plate. This is a huge cold plate. I'm gonna see, I, I planned on having it here. I'm taking a break from the fridge job because the Starlink guy is here, or the welder. Good. So yeah, they're gonna bolt it to the arch. And why are they bolting it and not welding it? They told me that because we're outside, the, the argon gas would blow off of the weld and the weld would sputter. And a lot of the time he, when he welds things like that, like flat things onto a tube, he can do it, but it's not gonna stay there. So this is gonna be like, <clears throat> Apparently I screwed something up because uh, this refrigerant's leaking everywhere. I'm, I know I'm gonna have to rebuild it. It sucks, man. It sucks. Uh, I don't know what's, what I did wrong, but I can't get this fitting. I'm gonna have to take this whole thing apart now. This whole, this whole thing needs to come off because this blue fitting just will not freaking go. I, ca I cannot get that thing. It's pissing refrigerate out now. I would have rather hired somebody else to just solder this stuff. It's just ridiculous. I'm very frustrated with this right now. I know what I did wrong now. I have the thermostat connected to here and it should be connected to here. It's working. Okay, last thing I gotta do is just use this spray foam stuff and spray a little foam in there. I gotta shake it for one minute first to seal all of the connections that we used. And then uh, we'll be done. And then we can just put our fridge away and let it get cold. Yay. Hola. We're going out to San Andreas Island today. We're gonna see what it has to offer. We got the spear fishing gear. We got, there's eight of us. This is gonna be fun. Jeez, say hi everybody. Hi. We got the Capitan of the Barco, Jaime, which is my, my name in Spanish, Jaime, Jamie. So I'm, I'm, I'm already loving that. I got a good energy from this cat. Yeah. So what's your, what's your, boat, what's your boat name? Los, Los Amigos. The Friends. The Friends, I like that too. And, uh, and I also, San Andres Fishing. See. Si. I am the sport fishing in the island. Ah, oh, that's awesome, man, cool. I want some fish. All right, we got something cool to show you guys. We're gonna go and see about a catch that, they, that the fishermen here found in the water, abandoned. And uh, they want to sell it, and the captain wants to buy it, but they want 65 grand for a boat they found. That's too much. Which is, I, I think, a little greedy. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go see the boat and assess it. We're not gonna really get on it, but just check a look at it, see what kind of what, what brand it is. I don't know anything about this boat. We're gonna go together. All right. Oh, it's American boat. Oh, that's a problem. <laughs> wow, this thing is old, holy shit. <laughs> Look at the bottom. That's, you, could, you could make soup on this thing. Yeah. It's aluminum mass. 
masts, yeah. Can you go around it one more time? Un más veja. The roller furler's done. It's got a hank on staysail, manual windlass, a fisherman anchor. It looks like it. It looks like it. It got pretty pretty banged up on the on the port side here. You see on the front. So it looks like it probably sh shook its mooring. Oh uh, yeah, it was on a mooring, and it and it had, went through a storm and it shook the mooring and it broke the lines. It looks like the chain smashed against this a lot. See it? That's all chain damage. The the bulwarks look okay. The tow rail looks okay. Stanchions are all bent and missing. The masts look okay. That all the whole deck house is is, is done. It, it got pretty beat up on the on the side. It might have been on a on a dock. I'd say this boat's worth ten thousand, bro. I, they're never gonna get sixty grand for this. There's no way. Sorry. The whole the whole top side needs to be rebuilt. This is an old boat. Muy viejo. Old. It's super super old. Uh. The casco is fiberglass, and the the top side is all teak. But you can see where it's separating; it needs to be rebuilt. And then the masts look okay. I think they're they're still good. That spreader's broken. You see the spreader there, so it needs a new spreader on that side. All new rigging, new sails, new new top side. You're gonna put a hundred thousand into that boat easy. Yeah, no, that's a horrible horrible buy. Don't do it. Yeah. There's no way in hell they're ever, they're crazy. They're smoking crack. How many crew you need for dry boat? I wouldn't pay one dollar for that thing. It would take a hundred thousand to make it into a nice boat. The, the worst boat you buy is free. This is, this is the, the belly of a tuna, you see it? That's the belly that he cut out of the tuna. Those are the dorsal fins. So he's gonna, that's a really good, yeah, nice job. Oh, he put a he put a tie wrap on it so it would stay. Oh, wow. And this is the most strong part of the fish. Two tie wraps, you see that one and this one? Okay, let's go. This is gonna catch us a big fish. I think it's uh. Oh, it's a, it's a, um, Ooh, oh, it's wow. a tune, bro. It looks like a tune. Yeah. It's a black tune. I caught one of these before. Wow. I thought it was a mahi, but it's a yellowfin tuna. It's a yellowfin tuna. Wow. I caught one of these. That's yeah. Wow, yeah, really bro. Fun. Tuna is the TV tonight. Sushi wow. tonight. Sushi wow. tonight. Make sure it goes in the boat. Don't get in the prop. In the boat. In the boat. In the boat. In the boat. Go, go, go. Don't, don't let off tension or he'll get away. <laughs> go, 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 go. You gotta pull it in so he doesn't doesn't shake it. There you go. There you go. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Oh, I think he got off. No, really? Yeah. No, he got off. He got off. Hey, hand out, hand out. No, 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 no. Your hand, out, out. Oh, he's still on. He's another tuna. It's the other brother. Hello, buddy. Hey. 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 Okay, mommy's going snorkeling. <laughs> mommy's going snorkeling. I'm so proud of her right now. Uh, yeah, that was good. Captain Jamie, wherever you are, you're a good dude. Sailing Zingaro!
And sailing Shanti. Sailing Shanti. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, let's get on my boat and let's take care of business. Okay,